Imagine you're walking into a room where everybody looks at you with awe. You're respected. Everyone looks up to you. Girls looking at you seductively. Dudes look at you with respect and a touch of fear. And you take the lead. Now stop imagining and listen to me. These are the three cardinal rules that Brad Pitt follows to become the coolest guy in the room. Okay, I don't think that I have to address the fact that Brad Pitt is one of the most good-looking and leading actor in Hollywood. He's dominating, cool, and everything about him is always on point. But why? In this video, we're going to be talking about why Brad Pitt is always the coolest guy in the room. Stay tuned, you can apply these things yourself and your game will be on point. Before anything, how many of you have watched Fight Club? If you haven't, after you watch this video, I don't care if you're eating, you're going to sleep, I don't care if you're fucking for Christ's sake, I want you to watch that movie. So let's go to the rules that Brad follows to be the coolest guy in the room. Number three, the way he carries himself. He's tall and he has a piercing and dominating gaze. All you need to do to carry yourself like him is this. When you're walking, go to a mirror or you can just practice this. Keep your back straight. Your shoulders back. Don't be afraid to look people in the eye. Speak fully with strong tone as I'm speaking now. Speak with confidence, with authority. And another thing, it is to don't succumb to beauty or authority. You can notice that when anyone beautiful or someone high value comes in the room, Brad Pitt remains cool. He does not care. He is the highest valuable person. Yes, it's hard if someone authoritative like your teacher, if you're a student, or your boss comes. But if you can, and if you have the opportunity, sometimes resist authority and, and rebel. You will gain respect and the coolness that you want. And it is, this is especially applicable to bullies. If you have a bully in your life, stand up for yourself. It is going to do you wonders, my friend. Wonders. And number two. Every minor detail in his body is sharp and elegant. Not even a single freckle on his tux. His smile. Everything is calculated. Look at the way he dresses. Every single detail is on point. Now you're not going to go and give an Oscar speech, right? Like Brad Pitt. But what I want you to do is to just take care of your dressing, of the accessories you wear, of how you take care of yourself, of how you look overall. Sometimes... It's okay to let go, but most of the times, take care of yourself if you want to be the coolest guy in the room. And number one is the perhaps the most important thing, and this alone can do wonders for you. If you can master this, everything else comes naturally. Everything else. This starts between your two ears. And it is that he realizes that he is the coolest guy in the room. Look, there's a saying that goes like this. Everything created in this world is created twice. First in the mind, then in the real world. Edison first created the light bulb in his mind. Elon Musk first created SpaceX in his mind. Tesla in his mind. Steve Jobs first created iPhone in his mind. So what am I trying to say here? Is that first create the cool guy in your mind. You are the cool guy. How do you look? You're dressing. What do you wear? Do you wear a bomber jacket, jeans? Do you wear a suit? How do you look? And then, another question. How do you look at others? You have respect for them, yet you are cooler than them. How do you stand? How's your posture? How do you speak? Take all of this in account. And if you do this, everything comes naturally. Believe me, if you can master this first point, Everything comes naturally. Now, these are the things that people write books about. But all you need to do is to understand these three. You don't need to become a master psychologist or something. You don't need to get a degree. Do these three things. I guarantee you, you will be more cool. But do this effectively with dedication. But as anything valuable in this world, like expensive artifacts and skills, it needs some polishing every single day from major to minor details. And if you want to grow and polish your skills on success, dealing with people, reaching your goals, being the coolest fucking guy everywhere. Overall, improving your mind every day. 
this is the platform for you. I can go much, much in depth in this topic, but for everyone to understand, I have talked in fundamental terms and that's all you need to become more cool today. Do this, you will be cool. You don't need to understand anything more. You don't have to get a degree on it. Just do these three things, you will be more cool, but do it with dedication and don't get me wrong. We are not as cool as Brad Pitt. We are not successful as Elon Musk, Jeff Bezos. But we are practicing. We are certainly in the road to it. And if you want to ride along, you know what to do. So, become cool and grow every day, friend. If you want more in-depth, another video like this, feel free to comment down below. So, choose your life. Do you want to be another Joe down the road? Or do you want to be motherfucking Brad Pitt? The choice is yours. Choose.